Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Alcoholic Phoenix here and welcome to Ark Extinction. Oh man, new DLC, new Ark experience. It's been a while guys and girls since you've seen Ark on the channel and I apologize for that but I kind of fell out of wanting to play this and with the new DLC out I promised many months ago that when the DLC dropped I would be on it and that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to get right in on it. So we're going to start with level 1 boy. Of course. We're going to drop everything but the frog mask. We're going to go straight for health. And we're going to explore this beautiful map together. So, I will mention, I've played a very, very small amount. Realized that my desktop audio was not recording. And now we're here. So as you can see, there's, there's the character I originally had that I spawned in with. It spawned in with my level 102 from a Emissa, apparently, for some reason, so... Uh, we just, you know, create a new survivor, no problem. But now we're going to explore this amazing map together. And one of the things we're going to need is we're going to need to do this. Bang. We're going to need to go straight for a stone pickaxe. We're going to have to do all the unlocky things. Now, I did get informed that there is obviously a way to auto level ingrams well i couldn't find it in the single player settings i'm aware of now how to do it but i have to exit the game to do it and i'm not doing that right now i'm too excited to play and i want to get into it and stuff so i'll try and do that before like in one of the next few episodes i don't know how many i'm going to record just tonight um but i'm super keen on playing so this this could be like one, two, three episodes, or it could just be an extremely long episode. I don't know. I got a coffee with me, which you probably just heard me slurping on, which is nice. Like me, a coffee. Let's just make a campfire as well, because we're going to need it. Even if we don't need it straight away, we're going to need it regardless. So what does is, what is hide unlock at? 15. We could literally get there so fast that I don't even think it's worth making cloth. Um, as you can tell, my rates are accelerated maybe a little bit too much, even for my liking, so that may get dropped down, uh, relatively soon as well. Let's put that on the bar. Bang. Boom. So, I know how to super, like, I, I know what I'm going to do just to quickly level up. This is also going to just learn this, that, that. That. We'll just do it that way. We'll learn the S plus version. Uh, let's go to this. So we need fiber. Super easy to get. Let's just do this. Um, I'm not sure what my frame statisticals are at right now. I don't have anything open for it, but we'll see in a moment. Maybe, maybe it's something I can look at in the settings. I'd have to. You have to pause to do that. Uh, I thought there was toggle extended HUD info. Hmm. All right. This will basically more or less do a little power levelly. I don't like that the engrams automatically open. Every time I level up, it's actually getting kind of annoying already. Man, there's some S plus stuff in here, dude. So, obviously I've got a, a tech mod um, installed so we don't actually have to get to fight all the bosses because this is single player and the idea of fighting the bosses or the chances of us actually beating any of them are slim to fuck all. I've got it installed for that safety net. You never know, I may try and fight some bosses at some point. I'm not going to ever say never. I haven't before. So, we'll have to see. Alright, well that's done. Um, can I carry that if I drop a lot of stuff? Okay, I can. We may just try and find a place and plop these down. Let's have a look around for a minute, though. This is awesome. 
Really, really awesome looking. Uh, something... Oh, I'm not going to be able to make one because I just dropped the materials that I need to make one. I was going to make a reusable spear, but we'll give it a minute. We'll give it a moment. Alright, so I did have a bit of a run around in this center area. I kind of got an idea of a spot that I wouldn't mind building at. Um, it's over this direction. Because basically off the start, the same as Aberration, water's going to be one of those annoying things that you need to try and find. Obviously you need water to survive. Um, we could more or less live anywhere because I do have the Bore Water mod installed. Which I believe S Plus has its own version, but I still stay, you know, tried and true to the Bore Water mod. It's always never done me wrong. So I've still got that, but I do believe there's an S Plus way to do it. It just, you know, doesn't matter. I'm not sure what these things flying around are. Oh, you look like you've been attacked, Iguanodon. You look very bloody. And I found out a couple dinos, like, that they're at least not aggressive towards me until I'm aggressive towards them. So that's nice. I believe if we walk, we'll be okay. I can't sprint, unfortunately, because otherwise we lose water far too quickly. I don't actually remember running past this bit. I must have ran near it, but not through it. Maybe I'm incorrect in that statement, but I just don't remember it. I did not want to pick up stone. I wanted to pick up some berries. So thanks for that game. Uh, let's just put some stuff down on the bar. Oh, well, actually, it's going to eat super slow if we do that. Stimberries, it doesn't matter if we eat. Urgh. Urgh. It hurts so good. Alright. Let's go this way. Hello. I've noticed there's a lot of tapajera around here. Or tape jar. However you want to say it. There's a lot of them around. Catch you later. Woo. You're like a level 12 boy. Yeah, there's a lot of those around I've noticed. Which is, you know, something rare for most maps. Like, trying to find those is normally a massive pain in the ass. You scared the absolute shit out of me, Mesopithecus. You really, really did. So. There's water down here. So I'm thinking down there might not be a bad spot. Only disadvantage to this area is... I don't... There's not a ton of trees on the ground itself, so we'd have to run up there to get trees, but that's okay, because, you know, eventually trees are going to literally, like, dissipate. Like, we're just going to end up knocking them out of the ground and have to go further and further out to get wood anyway, but we're also going to have dinos to help with that. Um, but we can get... Oh, shit. We're almost out of stamina. We've got to be careful. This water is extremely dark. I'm not sure what this is in the center, either. I saw this when I, when I had a quick run through earlier. Plus, I also had to check, like, FPS issues or anything that I was going to have. I'm actually not sure what frame rate I'm running at, but it feels like it's 60, at least. Or relatively close to it, so I'm not exactly sure what this is. Apart from the fact it kind of shows a projection of Earth. I guess it does show... Oh, fuck! Oh, that's not good. Very bad, very bad, very bad. Alright, well, we're just gonna die now. Ha! <laughs> Slight oversight. Hey. Oh, hello, Anklo. Where the fuck are we now? I don't know where I am relatively relative to where I just was. Maybe there's a an even closer area area, area with water. All right, so that's the desert zone out there, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, I I wasn't prepared for the snakes. 
I didn't actually see any hostile mobs near that earlier, so I didn't expect the snakes. This is probably death if I come off of here. Yup, certain death. It does look kind of pretty down there though, so I kind of want to figure out my way down there. Um, so this first episode is mainly going to obviously be a, a lot of running around, like, you know, that's just how the arc progression works, really. We start off with the old run around and stuff, and we figure it out from there. Why can I find... You know what? Every time I want stone, I can never find it on the ground. Ever. Can I get stone from you by hitting you? Of course I fucking can't. God damn it. Yeah, anytime I don't want it, I find it. Anytime I want it, can't find shit. There we go. There's some here. Very much a metropolis. Right, let's just do that. Is even metal? Like, is actually, from what I've seen, there's quite a bit of metal relatively uh, easily accessible around the area. So we should probably try and get ourselves spears. Um, I think that's pretty important, actually. We've also got to just figure out our way down to that lower area. Where we're not going to actually die trying to do it. Right, let's just do that. We'll make sure we can make... Well, we only need to make the one, so I don't know why I hit that multiple times. Let's do that. Let's drop this, that. We want to be... Sp we want to be fast for doing this. Have a bit of stamina about us. So, yeah, don't expect, obviously, massive changes to happen in the first 10 minutes of the freaking game. I just want to experience the game and, you know, take it slow and all that kind of stuff. Try and work out this world as we go along. I'm kind of hoping if I come down here, there might even be water I can jump into. Alright, this is risky. Because I know there's water down here. Oh god, the sound of that is horrible. Um... Do you think it's deep enough? We're gonna find out. Mm, please! You know what? That actually fucking worked, and I'm amazed that it did. So basically, these, these defense units. Now, I don't know whether they're aggressive towards me, because the times that I did check on what the name of them was, uh, they were attacking something else, so maybe they were just the AI was distracted with, uh, you know, other beings. I would imagine that if they're attacking parasaurs, though, that they're probably aggressive towards me. It's a, a nice assumption usually to make. Down here. Alright, so these boys that you see walking around, the ones with the tail just then, they're cool. They're fine. The only way they attack you is if you attack them. And... What I've noticed from attacking them, just to test, is that they don't... If you have enough health, basically, they'll eventually stop attacking you, and they'll leave you alone. They go into, like, this rage state that lasts for a small amount of time. Even if you're still standing next to them, they don't continuously attack you till you die. They do stop attacking you. I kind of like this area down here, so I want to have a look. Oh! So, from what I know, all um, Arc Dinos are supposed to be on this map. Uh, to my knowledge, they're supposed to be present on this map. So, we should be able to basically find anything we want, Dino-wise. I'm hoping that I'm not going to find a bunch of terrible Dinos that attack me and eat my asshole. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a pellet. Pelagornis. That's the name, right? Floating rock, game-breaking glitch. Right. I've had enough of that. But yeah, these boys are cool. I can't remember what they're called, though. Wild Enforcer. All right. So that thing's in a fight, which is good. So we're out in the unknown now. What is this called? The Wasteland. Hmm. Hello, Dodo. 
Wasteland doesn't sound like a great place. There's spiders and shit, dude. I don't like that. Spiders with no real proper weapons are not a, it's not a great thing to have to deal with. Doesn't look like there's any water out here either, so we're probably not going to stay out here. Probably at least going to live in Sanctuary for now, off the start. Uh, there's Carnos out here. I just kind of wanted to have a look. Try to avoid dying. That's a corrupted... These are corrupted... Uh, Pteranodons. So it does look like there is water out here, but this is definitely not the place for a low-level boy. With Carnos and stuff around, the be better to not take the risk, I guess. I do love the corrupted dinos, though. They do look really cool. I don't know what abilities corrupted dinos have versus regular dinos, whether it's just literally aesthetics. I'm, I'm not sure. Ah, well, this is pretty cool. I dig it, I dig it. I guess we should... Uh, let's just fucking... Kaplowie. Slick. Want to make sure we get some hide and stuff while we're at, while we're running around. We're going to need that relatively soon. So might as well kill the dodos because they're easy pickings. Yeah, that defense unit now is... It's dead. The turtle murdered it? Oh my god. You're a beast. Holy shit. What do you give me? Oh. Nothing, apparently. Strange. So if you kill them, it doesn't seem like you can harvest them. Unless you need something special to harvest them. Watch this. Angry at me now. Bye bye. Bye bye. Fuck you, turtle. I mean, we could kill it. Like, we can keep our distance. And it's already damaged. Look at our DPS numbers. Get littered with spears, you fuck. Oh shit, there's another one. Alright, let's just get away from that. What's up, my dude? How you doing? Yeah, it's very strange that we can't seem to harvest the defense units. I don't, I don't know what that's about. I don't know how to do it. Nothing. Uh, let's bump weight. Weight is going to be important to us. Oh, fuck off. I don't like compies at all. They're little assholes. One. Mm, ravages! They're not cool! Well, they are cool to have, but they're not cool to fucking mess with right this second. I need water. Don't die. I'm going to get water, we're going to try and build a super quick house down near the water, so we have a place to come back to. Then we'll think about going out and maybe taming one of those boys, because having a Ravager just to run around on isn't a bad idea. Unfortunately, Ravagers are kind of like glass cannons, so like they can be your best friends, but they're also relatively weak. Alright, I kind of want to test this. The defense unit doesn't seem interested in me. It seems to only... Is that a terror bird or something that it's attacking? Oh, I don't think it's attacking anything super bad. Alright, because we need, we need a base of operations at this point. Because we need a place to live. And put down a campfire and all that shiz. And we're hungry, and we need food for that very reason. 
Let's just eat these quickly. I gotta be careful not to accidentally eat the narcos and knock myself out. Uh, assume I need fiber. Be my assumption for this. One, two, three. We're just gonna build this uh, a little two by two. Nothing overly special. This is again a temp spot, or at least a temp base, but it may turn into a, a future base. We'll have to see how it shakes out. But I feel like this center area might not be a bad little spot to just place something down for now. Just to give us some form of housing to rely on. To make as many as we can. Hopefully, nothing fucks with me. Because I really don't want to have to fight off a hundred things at once. I'm just going to stay still for a minute. Try to not make many movements. At least the berries give me food. They don't give me fucking water, though, which is the most annoying thing. I see a wild enforcer hanging out. Now, if I can actually tame those, that would be super cool. I don't know whether I can. Like I said, this is not long after the DLC... Obviously, I've got S+, because why would you not? It's not going to be enough. I don't know whether I needed five of them. We'll do another need to, need to craft basis. Yeah, I only needed the one more. So let's go. The door frame, the door, and then I need one, two, okay, I've run out. Uh, door frame, oh well let's just do this. Okay, I'm pseudo protected, obviously I'm going to definitely upgrade this to wood when I have the chance. That is for damn sure. What am I missing? Just some fiber. Easy pickings. Okay. Now we have our first house. And we also have our... Or at least we can which we're going to do right now. We're going to get hide armor as quickly as possible. Is there a way to just automatically accept that as well, even? I've got to definitely turn on the auto engram leveling. All right. Now at least... We have some protection now. So we shouldn't hopefully die as easily. And of course, once we get our helmet made, we're going to put our frog dude on. Hell to the year. Look at that shit, boy. Right, let's put down our campfire. That we don't have. Which I thought I already made. What the hell? Doesn't matter. Um, let's put this near the door. We want the bed away from the door, I feel like. Not that it really matters, but... You know. Let's do that. Alright, so we're going to have some meat momentarily. Uh, so something... I don't, I'm not exactly sure why it matters that we live near water when I've got the boar water kit and we can basically live anywhere, but I guess it's aesthetically pleasing to be near the water. Although, if I need to pee while recording this, I guess I'm just screwed. Bed.
make sure we get the S plus bed. All right. Uh, let's put that bad boy in the corner as much as we can. Try not to clip it into the wall too much because you might spawn in the fucking wall knowing Ark and just keep dying over and over. Uh, I feel like we should get just storage to get it out of the way early. We then don't, don't have to worry about it in the future. What do we need? Just wood. Easy money. How you doing, my enforcer dude? Man, you are intimidating as fuck. I'm really glad they're not hostile. I was really worried that they were going to just fuck me up when I first saw them. But they're cool. Don't accidentally hit them or anything, but they're cool. S plus storage box. Let's just do that. Do that. I guess we've got to use them. Nice. Now we have all the emotes unlocked. Not that I remember my emote slot. I think it's... Oh, there we go. <laughs> Doesn't look as good when you've got an app. Whoops. Fuck. Uh, what was I doing? Storage box. Um... Exactly. Well, yeah. well, we should do it like this, actually. We can serve space that way better. As much as it looks shitty, we will conserve space. The fuck is that? Did you hear that? It's like a meteor. It was that way. The fuck was that? I did hear about supply drops or something that you can get shit from. Is that what that was? Holy shit. That was loud as hell. Oh yeah. Juicy meats. Good for sustenance. Um, let's go water skin. Can't learn the jar yet. What's up? So I think maybe we could do, get a bowler, maybe try and tame one of those ravages if we can get all the stuff we need for it, which we're going to need uh, some stone, I know this much, because we want to make mortar and pestle. Uh, we need to learn it of course, fucking, I really got to figure out that auto, get that auto engram stuff going I guess, don't I? Otherwise, it's going to probably annoy me to have to keep learning shit over and over. Alright. We've got that. Let's learn narcotic. I guess we'll learn spark powder too, because we're going to need it anyway. Alrighty. Now, we just need a bunch of narco berries, and we're good. Basically, let's put what stuff we do have in here for a moment. Just so we can pick up more shit. That scared me so much when that bush went flying. I thought it was like a spider. I, I pooed just a little bit. Also, it kind of looks... There's a turtle. Is he mad? No, of course he's not. Damn it. My coffee's cold. Forgot about it. That was a very cold coffee. Right, let's put this in here. Uh, berries. 
We're going to need our meat spoiler, and I've been informed in the comments as well that the meat spoiler, like there's a mod out there that's better for the meat spoiler. Why am I doing this? I should hopefully be able to just do this. Not enough resources. Flint, flint. Alright, I'll get your damn flint. Happy? Plenty of flint. For now. I do like that we can just step up into this one. I have to put the stairs there for a moment. Do that. Oh. i got to remember that my use button is... something in my keyboard. I just wanted to get it out. Uh, where's the mouse? There it is. Sweet. Let's put this next to it. Let's grab a bunch of this meat. Let's do it like that. And we're going to turn the meat spoiler on. It's going to play its little jingle to us. Which is fine. I don't mind the jingle. What's wrong? Why is my keyboard not sitting level? Feet keep kicking in. There we go. Got it. Ba -da 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 -da. <laughs> I like it. Maybe it's just me, and it, it might annoy everybody, but I kind of like the little musical stylings of the uh, meat spoiler. All right. Get some narcotic going. We're gonna need more narco berries. It's going to be easier once we get a dino that's a berry collector. But for now, this is an easy method to do this. So I know a lot of a lot of YouTubers generally, one, they do a lot of editing on their arc stuff. They cut out a lot of monotonous stuff, but me, meh. I feel like some of you guys and girls might enjoy seeing the progression through this DLC from the from the onset. I just picked up wood off the ground. Alright, you've had enough. Let's craft as many as we can. I guess we probably we might even be out of spoiled meat. We are. Alright. We're gonna end up with a lot of narcotic now. We need arrows as well as a bow. Bow. Yes, learn the prerequisites. Arrows, bang, bang. Arrow. Let's make 30 if we can. Maybe, maybe another 10 wouldn't, wouldn't hurt. Nope. We have to wait till there's not enough. Just keep making them. Alright. So we're going to level up very quickly as well, but I still wanted to um, level up from 0 to 100. I, just, I don't know, I'm strange like that. I just felt thought it'd be better to do it that way. Uh, we need to get a bow crafted as well. Uh, I wouldn't even mind going straight to grabbing the, up, the upgrade station get that as well. Um, let's grab the upgrade station. I've got two different kinds. Ah, oh, one's made of crystal and shit. Do I have metal? I believe I do. I don't have enough. I can get that pretty easily, I feel like. Let's also just do this. Bang. Put these on here. get bowler as well. We'll use the reusable bowlers, obviously. Why wouldn't we with the reusable mod? I'm going to try and link all the mods I'm using in the description. I should remember, because it's in some of my older ARC videos, and I haven't really added any mods since I did those videos. So, they should be all the same. I've probably disabled a few of them that I can't remember off the top of my head, though. Exactly what I disabled, but you know, it's to your own discretion, really. You can just get the collection pack and then add the put the ones active that you actually want. Um, what was I going? I don't know what they are. 
I don't know what they are because I don't have a spyglass to see them and they never land, I don't think, so I can't check them. I was going to go for the upgrade station, that's what I was going to try and do. We need to find metal for that to make it easier. Although, if we find these... Jesus. Easy hide, bro. They didn't kill these. I don't know what killed them, but I did not. I wonder if there's actually a metal spawn near us. What's what's my luck that it's miles away and I picked this fucking spot? You're I think you're cool unless I attack you. Megatherium, yeah. I think you're you're a cool dude. Cause I've seen quite a few metal spawns around on this map just looking at bits and pieces. When I did my little run through earlier. Oh shit. Um, and my luck is I've probably found the one of the spots that doesn't have any. Man, I run out of stamina quick from jumping. I need to remember that. Uh, what's down here? Does this go even deeper? Oh shit, it's like a cavern. Wow. That's kind of nice down there. What's the... Probably should get away from the edge because I'll get bumped off. Some dino will come up behind me and just, whoof, see you later. Let's get our stam up. We want our stamina upgraded. And because obviously we're playing single player, like to me, the leveling up, it doesn't matter very much. Like, it's not like we're, we're leveling up and a bunch of people on the server are like getting screwed over because there's nobody on the server. It's literally just me playing, so it doesn't matter. Um, let's see if we can get some metal out of this. Alright. That'll do us. That gives us the upgrade station. We can get this bow charged up a little bit. Ugh! Upgrade station. Let's do that. Boom. Now, if you guys and girls haven't seen the upgrade station before, basically what it does is allows us to upgrade our items. Um, instead of having to find blueprints, we can just straight out upgrade them. It costs us stuff, obviously, to do so. So we attempt an upgrade. We need 80 more, 84 more fiber and a bunch of wood. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab fiber. We're going to grab wood. We're going to need a lot more wood than that, but we can upgrade it at least once. Now we try it again. Well, okay. See, now we need more wood. So it tears up progressively. Like it, it costs you more and more resources. Now, in a multiplayer setting where stuff is very slow to get, that is extremely balanced to me. It's kind of why I like the mod. It just it means I don't have to hunt for blueprints. Obviously, some blueprint, like some items, I can't just straight out upgrade, so I'm going to have to find fucking blueprints for them. I'm also going to have to drop something to get my weight down enough to be able to jump. Here we go. Let's put this stuff in there, because we might need it at some point. Now, we've got a level 390% damage bow. An ascended bow. Basic bow, which is fine. You know, we don't, we don't obviously, we're obviously going to go for the higher tier bows, like the crossbow and stuff, at a point as well. But for now, this is Lewis. It's actually pretty decent. I don't, I don't have Dodo Rex open or anything in front of me to check statistic, or, you know, statistically and anal analyze it. But now let's see. If there's a Ravager up here of some kind that we can partake in trying to tame still. I hear that again. That time it's this way. Now. I hear something, but I don't see it. That's freaking me the fuck out, man. Where is it? What is it and where is it? It's so loud! 
But I don't see anything. What the fuck was that? That scared the living shit out of me. I thought we were about to get mauled. What the fuck? I don't know, man. I don't know what that was. Was it up there, maybe? It just sounded like it was right next to me. Alright, let's see. We should probably have our bowler out. Now, the Ravagers were around here. There's Scorps over there. Oh, there they are. See them. They're going after the Scorpions. Um. Alright, let's just... Fucking rip Dodo. Oh, rip me, I guess. You can bowler it. Can't bowler the spider. It would seem. Fuck. It's here again. Is it in the wall? I think it's stuck in the wall. I don't know what it is, but I don't really want to find out either. Okay, we threw the spear kind of in its general direction. It's like, bah! We don't have normal arrows to use. Okay, it got it, they got interested in the... Um, whatever the f fuck it is. Yeah, there's something in that wall, man. Bye, spider! Fuck you! Oh, it's Kano, and it clipped through the wall. That was not there. All right. Now, we've obviously got an Alpha Ravager and a regular Ravager. Oh, fuck, the Kano's here. He keeps running away from me. I don't know why. What in the fuck? I can't run. I can't run. And I'm scared. Ah! What the fuck is going on? Ah! Oh, 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 jeez. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, wah, wah. This thing is like teleporting and shit. What the fuck? Oh, we're fucking dead, dude. We're fucking dead, mate. Please, 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 please. I don't think the bowler works on something that big, otherwise I would try it. Oh my god, we knocked it out. There's a scorpion there. Oh, fuck. Okay. We're gonna quickly do that and we're gonna run. Holy shiitake mushrooms, dude. Oh, what the fuck is going on? It's like it teleported. Ah, go away. I'm so glad that I used Trank Arrows on that guy. Otherwise, I'd be dead right now. Okay, we need arrows bad. Let's just get normal arrows. We need to start, like, killing shit and clearing it out of the uh, area. Alright, uh, come on. That was fucked. That was actually fucked. 
Oh shit! I didn't mean to jump near you. I didn't see what level you were. Level four? Oh, you're dead. Get the fuck off me. You bitch. Take your chitin. Hmm. Nothing good. That was ridiculous. I don't know. Whew. All right, well, you can, like, be your homie now. Um. <laughs> what the fuck? That was insane. Uh oh. I don't know what that was. I tried to swap out the arrows and it like froze up on me. Alright. We're alive somehow. That was a clusterfuck of epic proportions. There's another fucking Kano up here, man. What level are you, Ravager? Oh, it's a hy oh, it's a hydrodon. I don't want you. Fuck. All right. I don't know what level these carnos are though. I'm interested. You gonna you gonna bark at me and run away? Yeah, you little bitch. That's what I thought, man. What are you? 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 Tell me your level. Forty-eight. Okay. You're pretty quick. Quicker than I expected. Oh. Big, big jump boost. Oh, God. Give me the water. It won't let me drink. Okay, we were able to drink now. Oh, we're dead. We're fucking dead. We're fucking dead. This was a dumb mistake. This was stupid. Why am I dumb? Oh, no! Fuck, we got a bed. It's alright. They're outside now, though, because we let them straight home. Fuck off. And unfortunately, the Kano we've tamed that should be over here. How you doing, Kano? Hey, man. You wanna, you wanna follow Mr. Phoenix here? Why? Like, I don't know whether I'm slower or they're quicker. I, I'm just used to outrunning that shit, and I can't. But we're gonna get our stuff back. That's what we're gonna do. Oh, you are quick. You are a very quick boy. Alright. Fuck off! You died serving Mr. Phoenix. You were a great Kano. Now I've got a new boy. Girl. It's very low health though, so it's going to have to be nursed back to health. But I appreciate you, that you tried. That's all that matters. Oh my god. That is ridiculous, dude. I should have really put move speed on this. Try to outrun these things next time. 
I don't know what happened to the other one. I guess it died. What's going on over here? <gasps> Raptors. How you doing? We're just going to bowler you again. All right. No, we're not. Now we are. Slick. I'm going to shoot you in the ass because I'm scared I'm going to knock you, like I'm going to kill you. Alright. Okay. Shall create an army by the end of this episode. Sup, my dude? You just got blapped. Insane than I thought they would be. All right, let's start getting this shit. Let's learn everything. at some point. Just going through these to see what we actually need. That could be good. Might need that. Um, I guess we should look. Raptor saddle we can learn. Can we learn the Kano saddle though? Nope. 46. How you doing, dude? You girl or dude? You're a girl. How you doing? You wanna be friends? Maybe friends up. Oh. Um Enable only target conscious. What? Change attack your target. Oh, there we go. We want neutral. We don't want you attacking the, uh, the knocked out Kano there. Alright. But we want you attacking anything that hurts you. So, let's look at the raptor. Oh, sick. We got a car now. Hey, how you doing? L to the yeah, dude. All right, let's just get this stuff off of me. That's just gonna weigh you, weigh me down. What's up? All right. At least we got something to at least ride around to to have a look around the map. I'm hoping that its stamina is good enough. You know what? We should eat this corpse because it's going to give us levels, and levels are important. Um. Let's just drop that, that, half of that, oh, half of that. 
Okay. Now, I haven't explored much out in the wasteland. I kind of want to have a look. Should also eat before we forget to do it. I would have preferred to go out on the Kano for its strength in case we get in a fight and we can't get away. But, Raptor's okay, I guess. It's going to have to do for now, at least. The Kano would have been a little bit slower, but it definitely would have been a lot stronger. Can we not jump with these guys? What happened to being able to jump with the Raptors? What the fuck? There's other Raptors out here. Are we going to get in a fight with the other Raptors? I don't remember. Oh, yeah, we are. You're overheating. Harsh conditions cause food hypothermia consumption. Oh, shit. Apparently everything is pissed at us. Out here. Well, that's cool. Actually. Fuck, 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 fuck. Because we can actually outrun the Carnos now. Don't one hit me. Okay. Keep following me, Kano. Oh! Boom! Oh. Maybe you can't just knock them out? Did you have to? Oh! Corrupted... Nodule? These incredibly strong lightweight nodules are somehow naturally made in a corrupted creature. Incredibly hazardous to human health if consumed. Um... Alrighty. Can we do anything with that? Or is that for, like, making kibbles for other things of some kind? I'm not sure. I mean, the wasteland seems like it sucks. In some ways. You're not pissed at us, are you? Oh, yeah, you are. Everything's just angry all the time, man! Are you angry at me? Okay, no, but it seems like... Oh, shit! Ugh, don't shit now! Bad time to shit! Yeah, apparently I just can't jump, which is very strange. Oh, this boy is real quick, and he's mad as fuck. Okay, we got away. We're fine. Huh. Well, the wasteland is an interesting place. I will say that. Ain't no doubt about it. You're easy pickings, aren't you? What are you? Parasol level 20? Oh, you'll die easy. Sorry, homie, I need the levels. Uh, Raptors, if I can get a few of them for a pack, it'll be real good. By themselves, they're not great. Why can't I jump with them anymore, though? When the fuck did they make that change? And why did they make that change? There's a... F There's a fucking Kano in here or underneath here or something. I see it, see? Devs, plays ban. He's under. He's he's meshing. I know the devs don't care about meshing. That's the joke. It's funny. See his tail. I wonder if I can hit him. Oh, he can hit me. That's some fucking shit. 
All right, well, we know where the uh, the sound of the Kano is coming from. I thought he was stuck. I don't know whether he's stuck in the wall or stuck underneath me, but now I've learned he's stuck underneath the floor. Makes perfect sense. Level 100 now. You're growing up in the world, aren't you? Yes, you are. You're growing up. Very, very, very good. That's you, a cute little raptor. Hi, Kano. You magnificent creature, you. Oh, Jesus. I did want, not want you to come over this way. Come this way. This way. I'm actually... Trying to get you to stand front and center next to the house, please. There you go. Beautiful. Alright. Well, anyway, guys and girls, that is going to be the end of the first episode of my Ark Extinction Let's Play. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see my Ark Survival Evolved in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Alright, poi!